Hello fellow tree fuckers, it is your game of boys, Dread Fury Lennon 3 Hoovies, back with what slaps, a weapon commentary, but not just any weapon commentary, a Hue Long Heater video. So let's get into this glorified cigarette lighter and all its flaws. So, the Hue Long Heater is the only heavy weapon of its kind. It is a fire-based minigun meant to be used with a pocket pyro. The Hulong creates a ring of fire around the heavy and consumes 4 ammo every fucking half second it's revved. This fucking sucks because you can't rev jump without burning through ammo. It ignites enemies in the radius of the fire circle. Of course, this is accompanied by a negative 10% bullet damage which is contradicted with its plus 25% damage towards burning players. This makes the weapon's only real advantage over stock useless unless you're always beside a pyro. Which is like never gonna happen. The Heelong was designed as a direct counter to spies. The problem is that spies can jump over the ring of fire the Heelong makes. This makes the weapon fucking useless in a direct downgrade of stock or Thomas Love. Of course you can still use this weapon effectively if your friend wants to pocket use pyro, but if you're playing casual and comp, overall this weapon is generally horrible. This weapon's stats are fine, but its main mechanic is broken as fuck. If Valve made the Hulon Cater fire ring propel spies backwards and light them on fire, then the weapon would be useful. This would mean a spy wanting to kill a heavy would have to use their gun, which in most cases, I think we can all say, isn't very effective because heavies surround their teams, and in most cases, if a spy uncloaks undisguised, or even disguised behind a heavy, the entire team's going to fuck him up pretty quickly. So we can all say, with confidence, that the Hulong would protect all heavies from spies effectively.